The rule book's been tossed out because tonight, WWE goes extreme. When it comes to rules, there are no rules tonight because this is Extreme Rules. What a way to start the night. An Extreme Rules matchup that will shape the foundations of WWE. Singles action on tap right now. The match we have next is going to be awesome. Stay where you are. Oh, I cannot wait. This is going to be good. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from West Newberry, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 251 pounds, John.
slam. What a stomp. Good grief. Guys, there's something special about competing on a WWE pay-per-view event. Sure, having a match on Raw or SmackDown is absolutely amazing, but there's nothing quite like the bright lights of a WWE pay-per-view. you got to believe this one's over. Now it's Roman Reigns on his heels. He's still got plenty of gas left in his tank, though. Sure, he's taking some punishment here, but given how much he prefers to be on the outside of the ring, he can very well change the outlook of the match with one shot. I agree with your earlier point, Michael. There's nothing like the bright lights of a WWE pay-per-view, but there's also nothing like the pressure of competing on a WWE pay-per-view. A loss here could set you back quite a bit. Yeah, but a win, now that could be career-changing. Think about it. He goes for the cover. And Cena kicks out. Cena shakes off things like that in his sleep. John Cena with a nice reversal. There have been a lot of great moments on pay-per-view over the years. And for me, one of my favorites was watching Kurt Angle's debut match at the 1999 Survivor Series. All my buddies and I gathered around the TV cheering on our hometown boy, Kurt Angle. Roman Reigns just too fast for him. Wicked clothesline. Take it off his feet here. And it's moves like that that make him so dangerous. Back to Kurt Angle's WWE debut. We should note that he defeated Sean Stasiak that night using his patented angle slam. And from there, the rest is history. Speaking of history, longtime WWE fans may remember Sean Stasiak's father, Stan Stasiak, who's famous for defeating Pedro Morales for the WWE Championship in December of 1973. Stasiak went on to hold the title for only nine days, though it's nine more days than most competitors will ever hold. just too fast for him. I gotta say, I don't remember the last time I heard a more passionate crowd than the one we have here tonight. They are clearly oh. fired up at this pay-per-view in their arena. He always had great Man. stamina. See if it lasts here. In addition to this crowd being incredibly passionate here tonight, so are our fans watching here at home. In fact, it's me. he's going for the pin. That was an easy kick out for Roman. Clearly not enough damage done. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. He's looking Superman punch. He's in this battle's not over yet. Gonna take more than that. much more punishment if he wants to win this match. This is what he's not going to go quietly. No superstar will this son ever does. Measuring. 
Here we go. John Cena's harsh impact. That shoulders on the mat. Two. Barely at two and a half. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Here he goes. Looking to ooh, impact. What an assault on our way. Yeah, but can John Cena take advantage now? Getting it done. This is the Cena that's just about unstoppable. Cena ready to close it out. You can't see me. And the five knuckle shuffle. Ooh. Here's his moment, Michael. Yeah, but can John Cena take advantage now? Counter here. He's got him on his heels and shows no signs of letting up. Oh, Roman Reigns saw that one come. Roman Reigns. Superman Pops. Good night. That's how you put an exclamation point on the end of the match, guys. A clubbing blow, Cole. That should end it. Oh, that was a close call. Yeah, but he's hurt, guys. What a hellaciously physical match these gladiators have put themselves through. The intensity of this has been incredible. Reigns sizing up the target. A spear! Cut him in half. That's how you put an exclamation point on a match. We got a cover! One! Two! I don't know too many other guys that would have been able to kick out of that. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Oh, man! He might have it. Oh, what's this? Boom! I don't know. Is that enough to stop? He's firing out on cylinders. He's got him on his heels and shows no signs of letting up. This is the Cena that's just about unstoppable. Uh, setting him up in position here. On the second round. Absolutely spiked. DDT. What's he looking to do here? STF is in. STF is in. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Bold move going for it again. Wow, he escapes it. He's just got no quit in him here tonight, Cole. Oh, the reversal by John Cena. When this guy's on, look out. Hoping to end it here. This is it. Two. And he got a near fall out of it. And the Cena Nation doing everything they can to keep John Cena in this match. It's called the Superman Punch. There is eight a pin attack. One, two, gets the shoulder up well. What's it going to take? Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. John Cena is measuring. He wants it one more time. Assault on the lower back. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Looks like the second time is going to be the charm. John Cena wins! Big match, John strikes again. Corey, I think that might be the biggest win of that young man's career. It's hard not to agree with you, Cole. It was an incredible victory. Yeah, I mean, a hard-fought matchup. And that's a great show of respect. Tremendous sportsmanship. Gotta love it.
The wait is over. This one's for all the marbles, and it's coming up next. In a match that will be etched in the record books. This is what these superstars dream about. A chance for a title. This is just dumb. It's not dumb, Cole. It's Logan. You believe this is dumb. It's the yin and the yang. It's the light in the dark. It's the deleter of worlds. Hey, Corey. What? You think I could be woken? Absolutely not, Byron Saxton. You are an ignoramus. I do have an idea, though, what? Byron. What about me? Go jump in the lake that he already has and. the Miz and what is the B team man they pick things up listen it's not about how the world sees you it's how you see yourself and the B team sees themselves as the best I think these two are ungrateful and they should be embarrassed to show their faces after betraying the Miz, who benefited them like no one else in their careers. Oh, stop being a jealous Judy. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 521 pounds, Matt Hardy and Bray Wyatt. And their opponent, at a combined weight of 462 pounds, they are the Raw Tag Team Champions, Curtis Axel and Bo Dallas, the B Team. Don't change that dial. Now, champ not looking good right now. 
The Tornado Tag Team atmosphere appears to be getting the best of him here. He's been gambling quite a bit here tonight. There's plenty of reward that goes along with being outside the ring as much as he has been. But there's a ton of potential risk. This thing appears to be slipping away from him in a hurry, guys. And you can bet he envisioned things going much differently for him heading into this match. Obviously a great opportunity here for the challenger who can't afford to make any mistakes here tonight. Not when you're in the ring with a champion as dominant as this one. Oh, what a right! Man, yeah, that's an attitude behind it. Bray Wyatt on the defensive. So much on the line here in the match for him. To follow up Byron's earlier point, the challenger has to remember just how rare championship opportunities truly are here in WWE. A loss here could result in a trip to the back of the line. Don't worry, Cole. This isn't the challenger's first rodeo. Everybody knows exactly what's at stake here. Oh, no. Big time impact from way up high. Curtis Axel looks to be in some pretty bad trouble here. How can he get out of this mess? And at this point, how much more does he have to give? Bowen Allen's looking to finish this one early. An easy kick out there. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. A lot of people are saying the champion has never looked better, but that doesn't mean we can't see an upset here tonight. And there's his speed paying off. Just attacking the back. <laughs> oh, man! Wyatt kicking some serious tail here. Bray Wyatt drives his opponent down with a Yurinagi. Not a good time to be Curtis Axel, fellas. As Byron was talking earlier about the champ being a heavy favor here tonight, I couldn't help but think back to the night Santino Morella defeated Umaga for the Intercontinental Championship in 2007. I don't think there was a person alive who thought Santino had even a sliver of hope, yeah, including Santino himself. But hey, as the old saying goes, anything can happen in the WWE. Ray Wyatt might get an early three count. Kicks out in the nick of time. Wow. Be careful not to get this qualified. Tornado DDT. Curtis Axel was able to get out of the way there. And that one grounds him. I didn't realize he had such a great side effect. Here's his moment, Michael. The number one contender's in firm His shoulders are down. Gets the shoulder up. Wow. What's it going to take? What a kick out. Counter here. On the shoulders here. And it could be a long way down from there. Oh, he is rolling. Eludes that one. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. Wyatt kicking some sadness. Gotta like the champ's chances now. Here's the pin title on the line. What a strike. And a slam. A bad place to be for the challenger. This is not at all how the challenger drew this one up. What a strike. Right on the mark. The challenger looking absolutely exhausted in there. At this point, his confidence has to be at zero. That's over at this point. Yeah, but I still feel the vessel that it... He's looking for the win. Bringing it back between the ropes. And he kicks out. Matt Hardy is far too woken to remain down now. Opponent down with a Yurinagi. Oh, it's over. Now, Ray Wyatt needs to capitalize on this opportunity. Boy, does he ever. And he's able to get out. He's still in this. Oh, he's got him here. He's got him. Sidewalk slam. Almost drove him through the ring. Now, Bray Wyatt. Sister Abigail delivered by Bray Wyatt. That has got to be it. There's the cover. Can he do it? He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh, what impact. He's got a boatload of energy. See if it lasts. 
We know what's coming. That was the boat dazzler. Is it enough to end this match? Things don't look good for Bray Wyatt. And look at the quickness by Wyatt. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Side effect. The championship is in serious jeopardy, guys. Bray Wyatt drives his opponent down with Yaranagi. Don't be surprised if we try a new champ here. to win this thing. Things don't look good for Kurt. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. New champion. Three. Yes. Unreal performance. This team continues and continues to win, but the problem is, are they going to implode before they... Oh, whoa, 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 wait a minute. We may see that implosion right here. I, I, don't, I just don't get this. You win a match, and then you fight with your own partner. These two men clearly don't like each other, and maybe never will. contest is a steel cage match and it's for the Raw Women's Championship. Here comes the war goddess. Her entrance is just as unique as her offensive playbook. Guys, what better way to start the night off than with this one? I can't think of a better match to kick the night off, Michael. In fact, we haven't even gotten started yet, and I can assure you that this will be a tough match to follow. Alexa Bliss would toss glitter and smile and make you feel good. 
I like the days better now where you are not allowed to make direct eye contact with the goddess, Saxton. Is that why she never looks at me? Multi-time women's champion. Yeah, she's not afraid to remind. Introducing the challenger from Dallas, Texas, Ember Moon. Introducing the champion from Columbus, Ohio, the Raw Women's Champion, Alexa Bliss. If you would think about moving, you better apologize. undoubtedly be a thrilling steel cage match. This might be it! Oh my! What a stomp! Good grief! That's how you wear down your opponent. Oh my goodness, this hurts! City earlier today, guys, the only thing anybody was talking about was this title match. Everywhere I went, from the coffee shop to the bookstore, everybody was talking about this match. You gotta believe this one's over! Knee drop! A concerned look on the face of the champ. She might be a little caught off guard by the challenger. This is where we might just see one of these women pull away from the other for good. Byron, I had a similar experience as you this morning. Nearly every person at the gym I went to was talking about this title match, and rightfully so. This is an absolutely huge match. Okay, wait, wait. Let me get this straight. Byron spent the morning at the bookstore while you, Cole, went to the gym. Man, that's brilliant. You guys have any other jokes? I can tell you guys that this arena sold out in record time, and a lot of that has to do with this match in the ring right now. This is easily one of the most anticipated title matches in recent memory. She's looking at it. It doesn't look like she's going to get her to... And she breaks free. I don't know how she did it, but that was impressive. Like you were saying, Michael, when the news broke that this title match would take place here, I had dozens of people I know in and around the area calling and texting, just hoping I could get them tickets. That's how big this match is. Isn't that cute? Your friends actually think you have enough pull around here to get them tickets. Poor people. Uh-oh. Shoulder right in the midsection. We've seen champions head into matches maybe a little too confident, only to be picked off in the end. And guys, I can't help but wonder if we're going to see that again here tonight.
He's able to get out of the way there. Speaking of champions heading into matches a bit overconfident, one of the most glaring examples of that would have to be the honky-tonk man's attitude heading into his Intercontinental Championship defense at SummerSlam 1988. And we all know what happened to him on that night. <laughs> you are so right, Michael. That was great. Of course, though, it wasn't so great for the honky-tonk man who ended up losing his championship to the Ultimate Warrior in fewer than 30 seconds. Harsh impact. If you ask me, fellas, this championship match is among the most highly anticipated that we've seen in quite some time. Ooh, what impact. The champ comes into this match incredibly motivated, though all the motivation in the world might not help here tonight. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. Like you, Corey, I've had this championship match on my radar for quite some time. And so far, I think it's safe to say that it hasn't disappointed. No, it definitely hasn't, Michael, which is saying something, considering fans' expectations heading into tonight. I can tell you that they saw this as a potential match of the year candidate. And so far, I think it's delivered. Once again, thank you for tuning into this great women's matchup. Oh, nasty impact. Beautiful technique. And Ember Moon is fading fast here, guys. This match is clearly taking it all out of her. It's not looking good for her right now, guys. She's being absolutely outclassed inside that cage. Yeah, but we all know she's a fighter. Don't be surprised if she finds a way back in this thing. What a win for Alexa Bliss. We've got some highlights from the last one queued up. Here we go. Here is your winner. And that's the win to start off the night. If that's the type of action we're going to get all night long, I can't wait to see the rest of the car unfold. Just wait for what's up next. There's no telling what's going to happen in a battle like this. Versus a formidable opponent. Oh, we are going anywhere. question because you're not cool enough, but I'll ask Graves. Graves, are you ready to walk with Elias? Negative, Ghost Rider. Making his way to the ring from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 222 pounds, Elias. Listen, I can't deny his in-ring ability, but when it comes to his music, I got no time for Elias. Listen, you guys know Elias' lullabies are the number one cause of insomnia in the entire world? All right, I'll just answer my own question. Yeah, I knew that, if they are.
from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 235 pounds, Bobby just became absolutely glorious. Can I get a hallelujah? Hallelujah! Not from you, Byron. How many times do we have to go through this? I've been practicing all week. You haven't gotten any better. The sky is truly the limit for the glorious Bobby Roode. Bobby Roode knows how to make an entrance, and he's got the substance to back it up. This should be an incredible matchup. I mean, both men have extensive offensive tours, lasting endurance, and an insatiable appetite to be number one. The only thing that would make this match more enjoyable to watch would be if I was calling it without you two bozos interrupting me. Throughout his time in WWE, Elias has demonstrated an ability to defeat up and comers and veterans alike. Hey, sometimes with a six string on their back. Look, there's no doubting Elias' ability inside the ring. I just wish he'd take up something like making model airplanes instead of live musical performances, if those qualify as such. Oh, what impact! Oh, oh man! Boom! This might be it! Oh, my! <laughs> Nailed it. The cover. Bobby Roode pops the shoulder up too soon. Here we are, guys, more than three decades after the WWE helped revolutionize pay-per-view television, and we're still going strong. Only now, unlike back then, the best way to catch a WWE pay-per-view is on the WWE. He's got him covered. It's going to take more than that to keep his shoulders down. Still a lot more fight left. Ah, uh, fireman's carry. I'd have to agree with you, Michael. The best place to watch pay-per-views is on the... He's a long way from the three count, I can tell you that. That would have been a shocker. Oh, this is dangerous right here. No surprise that the sold-out signs went up early on this one, guys. Anytime a WWE pay-per-view rolls into town, you can bet it will be the hot. Yeah, I don't believe it that he didn't win this match right there. Too soon. He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh, it's locked in. He needs to capitalize on it now. Corey mentioned earlier that the soul... Here we go. <laughs> there it is. Uh-oh, this might be the end of a... Bobby Roode might get an early three count. Two, three. Unbelievable. This singles match is over.
Many would consider this an upset, Byron. Yeah, hard-fought victory for this superstar, but he definitely earned it. Yeah, look at it. His opponent, sore loser. Yeah, but apparently it backfired. That's what you get for not accepting a loss. And now the celebration can begin. The championship is up for grabs. Coming up next, there is nothing better than championship caliber matches. is a Fall Count Anywhere match and is for the Intercontinental Championship. Here comes the worst internet champion ever, Zack Ryder. that everybody Zack Ryder gets close to dumps him. I even have it on good authority that Zack Ryder's father gets paid a significant sum to sit in the front row. Okay, that's enough, Corey. Don't take away what Zack Ryder's accomplished here. Former United States champion, former tag team champion. Here comes the King Slayer! Seth freaking Rollins, the King Slayer, the architect, undeniably one of the best superstars WWE has seen this generation. Seth Rollins has made a career out of taking risks and seizing opportunities. Seth Rollins has been a multi-time champion, a Money in the Bank ladder match winner, debuted as part of the Shield with Reigns and Ambrose. Rollins thrives and he is driven by people doubting him, by people saying that he can't do something. Rollins will do it just to silence them and smile in their face. Making his way to the ring from Long Island, New York, weighing in at 224 pounds, Zack Ryder! Making his way to the ring, from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, he is the Intercontinental Champion, Seth Rollins! Stay tuned.
if you're facing off against Zack Ryder, a little bit wiser by that. Be prepared for a flurry of aerial attacks, devastating kicks, and of course, this punch. It's Long Island IZ. You know it. Here we go, fellas. I've been looking forward to this one for quite some time. Guys, in a title match like this one, on a stage as big as the one we're on now, you have to wonder how much nerves will become a factor. Oh, if you're rooting for Seth Rollins, you have reason to worry now. He is in a Here he we go. Cover. And only a one count. Remarkable. Drop kick. Oh, right in the back. Uh-oh, look oh, at this. And apply. Slam with authority. Circling back to your earlier point, Corey, you have to think nerves will play a big part in this match, which I think favors the champion, especially considering how many times the champ's been in big-time matches like this. I agree, the champ is used to the bright lights and bright stage. Dare I say, it's almost second nature at this point. The champion into the cover! That wasn't even close to three. Too yeah. soon. Set him up! slow down a bit here but he certainly comes into this championship match with a ton of momentum hey you're gonna get hurt in a match like this that's just the way it is there's really no way around it i know it's somewhat early still but this could be a pivotal oh, point man. in this match guys let's see how he reacts here One. and seth rollins with a quick kick out still a lot more fight left and it's zach ryder showing some agility Somebody wound him up, and he's off and running. A striking blow. But did he go for it too early? We may be looking at a power bomb here. That's exactly what it looked like to me, Cole. Oh, no, we could be looking at a power bomb. I think you're right, Cole. Look out. Thunderous slam. And it's Zack Ryder showing some agility. The challenger not looking good right now. The champ clearly getting the best of him here. He has to remember that his shoulders are down. And a kick out, not even close on that. He isn't going to go away that easy. When this guy's on, look out. Hook them. Oh, what a DDT. Wow. Lightning fast reflexes. Here's the moment. Fox with a knee right to the face. Just when you thought he had nothing left. The champion into the cover. Seth Rollins wins. These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. He's getting after it here. He really put on a great show. Here is your winner, and still the Intercontinental Champion, Seth Rollins. And the first match of the night comes to an end in thrilling fashion. And if that matches any indication of what to expect here tonight, we are in for an amazing evening. Plenty more action still to come here tonight. Up next is the long-awaited championship match. We have one of our breakout talents taking on some tough competition. The stakes are high and the superstars are ready. The 
the following contest is a steel cage match. And it's for the WWE Cruiserweight Championship. Mustafa Ali, one of the most exciting superstars in all of the WWE. Former Chicago police officer turned WWE superstar. A yeah, very motivated young superstar. He says he treats every match like it's a fight for his life. They call him the heart of 205 Live. The soul of WWE's cruiserweight division. Guys, Cedric Alexander had one of the best matches in the Cruiserweight Classic a couple of years ago. And it was so good, Triple H came out and imported the man and then signed him to a WWE contract. You know, you look at every superstar, and every superstar has their individual motivations. Well, for Cedric Alexander, it is simply to be a good role model for his young daughter to prove that as long as you put in the work, you can succeed at whatever you want to Introducing the challenger from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 182 pounds, Mustafa Ali. Introducing the champion from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 200 pounds, he is the WWE Cruiserweight Champion, Cedric Alexander. Don't go anywhere. Alexander really hit a career high when a tournament was set up to crown a new Cruiserweight Champion. Unfortunately for him, another superstar was having a similar renaissance, Mustafa Ali. Both Ali and Cedric had early exits from the Cruiserweight Classic in 2016 and moderate success on Tour Live in 2017. But the dawn of 2018 brought the Cruiserweight Championship Tournament where Ali and Cedric would meet in the finals at WrestleMania. Beautiful technique. Some serious damage to the arm being inflicted here. Ooh, what impact. Oh, oh man. Oh, nasty impact. The challenger's taking on some offense, but he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. Hey, you and I both know he's double tough. 
He's not going to let something like this stop him from winning the steel cage match. Oh, boy, what a slam! Impactful. It'll jar your spine. Boom, what impact! Harsh impact! Oh! Oh, nasty impact! The champ's starting to sweat. Don't be surprised if he shrugs it off and comes back more motivated than ever. I wouldn't call him the medics just yet, Cole. He still appears to be in pretty good shape here. Oh, what impact! Boom! <laughs> Nailed it! Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. Oh, that'll mess up the neck. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh, elbow in the face. Despite having an impressive spot in this week's power rankings, I'm told this superstar isn't all concerned with things like that. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. There's been a lot of talk about this superstar's latest spot in the power rankings, but if you ask me, those things are overblown. Ooh! <laughs> if you're this superstar, you gotta be happy about where you're listed in the recent power rankings. Oh, what impact! Harsh impact! Challenger's championship dreams are fading quickly. I mean, it looks to me like he's almost completely out. Oh, man. He's getting manhandled in there. I don't know how much more of this he can. Brain Buster. This one's over, guys. Got the reversal. Running Hurricane Rana. The champ on the defensive now. He's always ready for a fight and has seen his fair share of wars in WWE. This championship match is just another day at the office. Man, he was making it look easy there for a moment, which is pretty impressive considering who he's in the ring with. Oh! Wait a minute. Dangerous spot for him to be in. He's got to figure out a way to get back in it, guys. We might have a new champion here. Looking for the win. I don't think he's got it completely locked in. He broke out of it. Cole, how in the world did he find the energy to do that? Breaker, right to the lower back. Alexander looking to end it. Looking to find it. But he's got to capitalize now. He's a one-man wrecking crew. Boy, he is rolling. Oh, 
He's looking at it. Washed it out. Full Nelson face buster. Just when you thought he had nothing left. No reverses it. Whoa, Alexander dodged that one barely. Oh, that's the impact. And stomping away in the corner. Just ruthless. Here it comes. He's got him. Cedric Alexander looking to take the lumbar check. Now that's how you successfully defend your title. Yeah, that'll leave a mark. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose this opportunity. This might be it. Oh, my. You've got to believe this one's over. Beautiful technique. He's making a statement here with this attack. Whoa, Alexander dodged that one barely. What impact. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose this opportunity. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. The singles match has come to an end. Wow. I can't believe what we just witnessed. Steel cage matches never fail to surprise and amaze. Highlight for one superstar, low light for another. He ain't playing here. Here is your winner, and still the WWE Cruiserweight Champion. Alexander! Big win here to start the show. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match tells me we're looking at somebody who will someday, very soon, be competing in the... Welcome to Balor Club. Making his way to the ring. From Bray, County Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn Beller! One of the most incredible athletes to ever step foot in WWE, Finn Beller! This man is an enigma with a profound skill set that we have never witnessed before. A world-renowned super. 
power slam. Former NXT champion, the first ever Universal Champion, Finn Balor, ladies and gentlemen, is for real. A truly global superstar, a phenomenon amongst the WWE Universe. Finn Balor posted on social media earlier today that Balor Club is for everyone. Decorated combat athlete in history. Brock Lesnar is hazardous to your health. champ is paying attention to this one. It's only a matter of time before that gold is on the line against the number one contender. That suplex making it look easy. Now the old vicious head crank. Look at the torque. Well, if the champ's not paying attention to this match, as Corey suggested, we may very well be looking at the next champion in the ring right now in the number one contender. I don't know, Michael. I don't think the champion is so arrogant not to do the necessary homework. He's got him covered. Finn Balor towers the shoulder up. Balor shooting out of that pinfall like a bullet. Boom! <laughs> As this match continues to unfold, it would be interesting to see if the number one contender holds back in any way. After all, the last thing you want to do is get injured before your big match with the champion. Nailed it! You gotta believe this one's over! Byron, regarding your earlier 
thought on the number one contender, it seems like we're seeing the same level of competition. It doesn't appear to be any change in approach despite having a match with a champ on the horizon. I wouldn't expect anything less, Cole. Though there have been times when a superstar has been on the verge of the opportunity of a lifetime, only to have it... Look at Finn Balor making his moves. Brilliant Ross! He might have just ended this. Oh! Into a backslide in the pin attempt. This is what makes him one of the best in the... Looking for all the glory here. Oh boy, he is rolling. Backslide out of nowhere. Digging deep for a kick out. The Beast won't stay down. Brock Lesnar just too fast for him. Lightning speed from the Beast. more Finn Balor has left. This is not where he wants to be at this point in this match. Finn Balor fought an injury to become Universal Champion. Now he needs to fight that hard again right now. Uh-oh. In position. Look out. Here it comes. Oh, almost through the turnbuckle. That might just be the final nail in the coffin. Brock Lesnar is in a real bad spot here. Gonna have to shake off the moderate damage that's been inflicted here and find a way to maintain the upper hand. Beautiful technique. Ooh. Harsh impact. Taking a bit of a beating so far, but nothing that can't be overcome. This might be it! Oh my! Ooh, what impact! I really can't believe what's gone down so far. This match has been even more physical than I thought it would be. Oh, nasty impact. Beautiful technique. Harsh impact. Both of these superstars looking a little worse for wear right now. Terrific reversal by Finn Balor. Boom! <laughs> the Irishman has his Irish up. At this point, it looks like even the winner of this match will walk out of here beaten and battered. I'll tell you, the cage has absolutely beaten down these superstars. Yes! Takes it! When you introduce the enclosure, everything is possible. What a match this was. Here is your winner, Finn Balor! Kicking off the night with an impressive victory. And you just know the rest of the card...